Embark on a magical, bug-filled journey with Wes on new creation. Fluttering butterflies, buzzing bees, fascinating beetles, and even the misunderstood cockroaches are stealing the show. Join Wes and special guests as they unravel the secrets of these incredible insects. It's an adventure of discovery you won't want to miss. Get ready for a bug extravaganza, only on New Creation. Welcome back to New Creation. Each week we're looking at different insects with real experts. So far we've seen butterflies transform to beetles play dead. Let's see what's in store for us today. Hey Dr. Baldwin. Hi Wes. Today we're going to take a look at another fascinating insect, a honeybee. There's so many. There are, and they have an amazing life cycle. Remember how we talked about some insects go through a complete change from the time that they're babies until when they're adults? Right. So it's the larva, the pupa, and then the adults? Well, today we're going to take a look at some of these honeybees. Now the ones that you're looking at are the adult bees. How many do you think are there? Oh my, there are hundreds if not thousands on this one frame. Now, Wes, can you tell me what this frame is made of? Uh, honeycomb? Honeycomb. So bees spend several days of their life producing wax. They create these little hexagons that we call cells. So these are wax cells and the queen honeybee will lay an egg in each one of these cells. And then the worker honeybees will bring in food They'll make food that they'll feed to the larva. The larva then turn into pupa. Remember we talked about the cocoon mm -hmm. through the caterpillars? Right, right. Well, honeybees do the same thing. Then they're covered in wax. Like being in prison. The honeybees then have to chew their ways out. Did you know that honeybees have chewing, lapping mouth parts? I did not know that. So they chew their way out of their wax cell in order to go out and fulfill their duties, which could include scouting for food resources, bringing back nectar, bringing back pollen. If you look through here, you can even see some of the cells have honey. I had no idea that bees did all of that. That is absolutely wild. You know, when you were talking about imprisonment, it kind of reminded me of today's bright idea and Jesus frees us. It's a great message to live by and something to always remember. Well, I'm gonna try to not get stung, so see you guys next week.